most of them were coming from the coastlands, from agricultural regions. They don't have options. If they can't afford a private treatment or if they don't have social security, they will certainly die. La prevención es obvio que hay que empezar a hacerla ya. Detección temprana y prevención, si no, el presupuesto de salud que ya es insuficiente para todas las enfermedades del país, eh, no va a alcanzar. Most researchers agree that CKDNT is multicausal, but the leading hypothesis is that the combination of chronic dehydration, heat stress, and heavy labor and extreme heat may be one of the primary drivers of the disease. Exposure to agrochemicals and other environmental toxins are also being investigated as contributing factors. After some time observing and studying the way they work, uh, we started to notice that really their working conditions are extremely harsh. We always dreamed of doing an intervention study, trying to put the hypothesis to the test on the fields. La Isla Foundation and Solidaridad have partnered with the Salvadoran sugarcane producer Ingenio Alangel, the United States Occupational Safety and Health Administration, and leading researchers from around the world to launch the first ever CKDNT intervention. The Worker Health and Efficiency Program, or the WE program, aims to prevent the onset of disease among sugarcane workers while increasing the efficiency of their production. Este programa que es novedoso, por lo menos en la región, en Centroamérica, es el primero de este tipo y yo creo que va a ayudar mucho a minimizar la enfermedad renal crónica, especialmente en los trabajadores de la, la caña de azúcar. Some places on the coast are showing as high as 50% of the cutters with decreased kidney function. So this intervention really will have a big impact in El Salvador and cane communities all around the region. We hope that, that other mills will join us in doing research so that together we're uh, a stronger force in looking into this matter. Hoy contamos con la sombra apropiada con el agua justa, tomando el tiempo correcto. Este, ganando se puede decir más, porque ya no solo ganamos el dinero, también ganamos la, la batalla de, de controlar las, las enfermedades que antes se daban. We worked with experts from OSHA, that's the United States Occupational Safety and Health Administration in the Department of Labor, to adapt their water rest shade program so that sugar cane cutters could take frequent rest breaks under shade tents and have access to clean drinking water close to where they work. Si nosotros logramos encontrar que los trabajadores que participan en ella eh, no deterioran su función renal en el transcurso de la zafra, entonces vamos a encontrar un, un método de protección que luego puede ser generalizado a mayores poblaciones de trabajadores. Camelback is providing steeply discounted hydration backpacks to the El Angel Sugar Mill so that workers can hydrate continuously while they're working. Cuando la gente no tomaba agua, lo que hacía era que padecía más de isolación, de mal de orín, de, le daba infección en los riñones, y eso este año no se, no se ha dado. We think we can eliminate a lot of the energy that's used up by these guys and uh, probably increase their productivity by about 30%. Sugarcane efficiency experts from Australia worked with Elan Hell cane cutters to review best cutting practices and to introduce a specially bent machete. This new custom blade enables more efficient and less physically taxing work. He didn't want to use the other one anymore. And he never had a problem with his shoulder or elbow or wrist anymore, so that made us quite happy. <laughs> They're going to have more time to have a rest and still cut the same or, or a lot more cane. Preliminary data from the pilot study of the WEE program indicate that once workers receive the intervention, their kidney function stabilized. Symptoms of heat stress decreased significantly, so they felt better after a day of work. And their production increased by approximately 40% compared to the average tons cut by the same group last year. 
Ingenio El Angel has been a great partner in this project. They are involved in developing logistics and operational capacity to make the water rest shade and efficiency program work, but they have agreed that the scientific component is completely independent. They don't see the results before we publish them and they're not paying for any part of the scientific analysis. They're doing not only a very professional and scientific work, but profoundly honest and, and serious. And we hope the findings out of conviction will transform the, the industry into a, a better industry.